Good evening. It is Friday. I mean, it technically it's Saturday, but I'm calling this Friday. I just got home from my last day of college. I am officially done with school. Well, I got a couple things to be submitted, but other than that, I'm done. So, I just wanted to pop and say, hey, am I still reading Shadow of the Cause? You bet your bottom dollar. That's going to change this week because I will have time to read. So, I just wanted to quickly pop on and say, hey, how you doing? Oh, wait. Welcome back. Welcome to Tired Reads. If you're new here, welcome back to another week in reading vlog. My name is Jacob. Drop that. Oops. But yeah, I think I'm tired. I'm going to bed. This is a mess. I'm going to bed. I've got a lot of things to do tomorrow. We'll talk more then. Just want to say, hey. How you doing? It's Saturday and I have done zero reading and but I have done a lot on my to-do list which is great I have submitted all my stuff for school so I'm officially done with it <laughs> so I don't have a reading update for you but what I do have is my book of the month I forget what I got so I was like how did I forget how a box opens <laughs> let's open her up but how have you all been doing? I've been doing great. It was a stressful week, but it is done. I am, I'm a real adult now. I'm a real adult, aren't I? Hmm. It was, and then we'll watch a tell one. Alrighty. I kind of forgot what I got too. So my first book is A History of Wild Places by Shay Earnshaw. Okay, I believe it's like some kind of like, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Magical realism, thriller, Travis Wren has an unusual talent for locating missing people. It's a personal detective. Love that. And then the second book on my quote is Imposter Syndrome by Kathy Wong. Um, well, it says basically a novel about, a wom about women in the workplace, the power of tech, and the looming threat of an espionage. So this sounds very, very pleasing. So, great two picks. This was my, this is actually the no December pick, and then this was just an add-on that I've been wanting. But now that that's out of the way, I'm gonna change my sheets. It's also raining and very windy out, so sorry if you hear that. I would like to read a lot. Like I said, or I think yesterday I said it, I want to finish Shadow of the Gods this weekend, but I don't know if that, I don't know how plausible that is, but fingers crossed it is only... 5.45. But yeah, that's it. That's, that's all I got to say. Another thing that I've been debating about since we're here talking is I have a desktop Mac, but I think I want to trade that in for money because you can do that at the Apple store and put that money to a laptop because I've been like, I told myself that I like to sit at a workplace and like have that designated area. But now I hate being tethered to that one spot and I wish I could move around. 
and for work would be easier, but the problem is I got paid off. The problem is I don't have enough money at the moment. I just need to wait for like a paycheck or two. So that might be like a Christmas present for myself. Just thought I'd slip that in there for absolutely no reason. And I think that's it. I'll see you on the flip side, maybe later tonight when I read, but who really knows? We'll catch you soon. Good evening. It is 4.30 and I've read a bit, a little bit. I bought the audiobook for The Shadow of the Gods so I could read along with it just so I can keep track. It's not that I'm not enjoying it. I'm really enjoying it. It's just like, it's a me thing. It's a me problem. I think it's just more my mental health. <laughs> We're going there. It's just not in the best spot in the moment. I think I'm also trying to process like the end of the year emotions and graduating and all that. Um, some with other things, maybe we're in a depressive episode, who knows? But I, it's just like hard for me to like just focus, which I'm annoyed at myself for, but I just wanted to jump on and say, hey, let you know why I've been taking Three weeks to read this book but that will change I hope you are having a great weekend I'm about to be home I'm about to be home so I will be taking a shower reading I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish it today the audiobook says only three and a half hours so it's getting done today and then maybe I'll start a new one but yeah that's all I got for you at the moment I have to work tomorrow which is sad I wish I could have the day off. Uh, I don't know if there's anything else. I don't know. I think that's it. Not it? Yeah, I think that's it. I'll see you with the montage because I didn't give you one last time. I'm so sorry. I know you're you're hurt. And I'm gonna fill that void for that missing montage. I'll see you then. Alright, good evening. It is Monday night and I figured I should wrap up this vlog, even though there's barely any reading, if any, at all. Um, it was just not a good week, and mentally for me, I was quite busy, and I think I was processing, I think I said this earlier, I was processing the emotions of graduating, and leaving that place, and starting a new chapter, and it just got me into like a little bit of a weird funk that I couldn't just focus in on reading. Since tomorrow is like a day off for me for the first time in three months, I plan on filming a lot to backlog for something that's coming in the end of December. <laughs> but I am feeling a little bit better mentally now, so this vlog is mostly just montages and some fun songs. So we'll pick some fun songs for you to listen to. My goal is to finish Shadow of the Gods tomorrow. I know I've been saying that for too many weeks, <laughs> but now that my plate has cleared a little bit, I feel like I have anything. <sighs> Just exhale and breathe and take more time for myself to do the things that I've been wanting to do for a while or that I have been putting off because of school and I couldn't really focus on it. But all that to say, thank you so much for sticking around if you stuck around this long. I hope you had a great weekend, a great festive time if you celebrate any holidays. Let's see if the emoji that's like this, with like the blush, <laughs> that's my emoji representation. But like and subscribe if you're feeling it, no hard feelings. Comment down below if you, how you've been doing, how your December's going. I hope you had fun celebrating whatever you may be celebrating. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.